This video shows how to connect a battery pack for first time use or to replace it with a new pack. For a step by step procedure, check the operations manual for your instrument. Everything you need when you open the instrument can be found in the toolbox that comes with it. The internal battery pack is located inside the housing. Note that the instrument is shipped with the battery disconnected. Remove any existing connections from the instrument. Then take a moment to note how the end cap is matched with the housing. Take a picture of it or find it documented in the operations manual. Place the instrument with the end cap facing up and remove the four bolts using the tool provided. Place the tool supplied in a notch on each side of the canister. Twist in opposite directions to loosen the lid, then slowly lift up the end cap. Disconnect the Molex connectors. It may be necessary to have another person hold the end cap while disconnecting. Set the end cap aside and make sure not to scrape, damage, or lose the O-rings. Remove the old battery pack and slide the new one carefully into the housing, making sure to thread the cables through the hole. Connect the battery harness to the two two-pin connectors. Connect the other Molex connectors to the end cap and check that the grounding cable, green, yellow, is fastened. Check that the O-rings on the end cap are in good order. This is perhaps the most crucial step as it ensures the instrument does not leak. Make sure the end cap is oriented correctly as you put it back in place. Take special care that none of the wires are squeezed when replacing the end cap. Loosely cross tighten each screw before tightening properly. Note the washer and lock washer sequence. Make sure not to over tighten the screws. Simply tighten until hand tight, then do a quarter turn more. The blue LED will be lit for about 5 minutes after the new battery is connected. Checking this LED is a good way to verify that the battery replacement was successful. Note, you must recalibrate the compass after changing the battery, as the magnetic interference will be different from before.